Yo, what it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Spray Paint, back at you with another video, man. The other half of it's time for that Culture for the Street podcast. We back in these YouTube streets, and boy, we got a crazy segment. Boy, Freddie Gills. Man, what the hell you got going on, bro? Like, I'm finna delete all your music about my dog on, uh, it got to go. All your music that I deleted got to go, bro. You went out extra bad. I'm talking about extra bad. I don't think no rapper in history ever went out this bad. Uncle Murder, Uncle Murder gonna do you wrong. I already know DJ Academics definitely gonna, he definitely gonna slam you. But listen, y'all, yesterday, Freddie Gill's baby mama exposed that boy. Man, she uploaded a picture on Twitter of this nigga spreading his cheeks, dog. Like, this nigga literally spreading his cheeks. He, and then when, when he talked about it, he didn't even deny it. He didn't deny it at all, bro. Uh, Shout of best around and went to Twitter saying, blocking me on Twitter when I have a picture of you spreading your cheeks is insane. I'm going to spell them. I'm going to spell them, but that one, though, so basically she's saying, like, she got a bunch of pictures of this nigga doing all type of weird junk, and the picture's so nasty, bro. I, I Like, it's disgusting, my nigga. Like, it don't look like nothing no street nigga would do, nothing that a man with principles would do. Like, this nigga out of line. It's over with because she said... Not only do she got that picture on Twitter, it's another picture was there, but it's deleted. But there was a picture of him laying on his stomach, and she was laying on top of him looking like she giving him back shots. But this picture, let alone with him bending over, spreading his cheeks, like, bro, looked like a real, a real zesty disciple, man. Like... <laughs> Bro, it's over for you. You was a real cinnamon stick, dog. All that gangster stuff that you was talking about, my nigga. Boy, it's over with. It's, it's, it's over with. It's done. Now, a lot of people want to know, like, what is the reason for Shawty doing him like that? Well, she said that, you know, uh, during her pregnancy, he wasn't around like that. She tried to reach out to him. You know, they kept curving her. It ain't been no type of co-parenting going on. So, yesterday, on Valentine's Day, his new girlfriend posted a video of them two hugging. And on the caption, it said, Happy Valentine's Day, Freddie Gibbs. I'm in love with you unconditionally. Thank you for existing. You're my soulmate. Black love. Pounds, pound sign, forever, forever love. She posted that. So right after she posted that, that's when the baby mama went on Twitter and posted the picture of this nigga spreading his cheeks, dog. Like, what the hell wrong with you? You got embarrassed the worst way on Valentine's Day. You is the biggest sucker of 2024. Who does that? Who send their baby mama a picture of them bending over, spreading their cheeks? Nigga, nobody don't, like, who does that? And a lot of people were saying that, you know, the reason probably why Freddie wasn't messing with her because they said when she was pregnant with the child, they were saying that she was on OnlyFans busting it open or whatever the case may be. But still... Even if she did do that, that still don't give you the reason to be opening your cheeks, nigga, like you one of them zesty boys. Like, nigga, everything you stand for is crushed. Don't bring up nothing about the streets. And I'm pretty sure the vice lords ain't going to be messing with you no more either. They probably going to look at you different. Not saying you, you, you was involving with another man, but, bruh, Boy, that what you did, that could never be erased. And it's up forever because DJ Academics going to slam you every time you get wrong. Man, y'all drop a comment below. I'm gone.